Hey, Michael. How you been? Huh? You, uh... I mean, how do you like your new home? <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, buddy, 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 here, here, have some water. Oh, oh, buddy, here. It's okay, it's okay, we'll clean it up. It's just water. Hey, it's okay, hey. we'll, we'll, we'll clean it up. It's okay, baby. Come with Gammy. We'll watch some TV. We'll clean this up later. Uh, Mike? <laughs> or just lose it. What the hell are you doing? Man, most people use the pink fiberglass for insulation. This is soundproof. I'm a sound guy. Of course I insulate, but... Take a step back, hold on. You know what soundproof insulation is made of? Rock wool. Who cares? Rock wool is made of basalt, melamine, and slag, also known as ferrous ore. Same trace we found in Kara's throat and under Michael's nails. The water main to the house burst while Kara and Michael were trapped inside this room. Nobody could hear her scream because the room was soundproofed. And then Kara and Michael tried to claw their way out of the room. You must have found Kara shortly after she died. You thought Michael was dead, so you buried him with his mother. What? About four months ago, Kara came back home. I hadn't seen her in eight years. She had Michael now. She was pregnant again, begging for money. What you, why, why didn't you tell me? She said she was going to give her baby away. Just needed a place to stay, so I gave her the apartment while you were out of town. I kept them down there to keep them safe. I thought you, she... What? I, the water pipe, the drowning, it was all an accident. Stop. No, Shut she, up. We found Kara's baby. She was going to give away in the same field you buried Kara and Michael. Here's what's interesting, Pete. We ran that baby's DNA against yours. You're a match. <laughs> what did you do? You want to run that story back for us? Kara didn't run away. You locked her away. You stole her life. You abused her for eight <laughs> years in that basement. Stand up. I'm not who you think I am. I, I couldn't let her leave. I love Kara. I love no, her. No, what you did wasn't love. Up now. I'm not buying it. How could Mary not know what Pete was doing for eight whole years? Every family secret is built on denial. And if you don't see it, you don't have to face it. Something about Mary that isn't right. She spent the past eight years of her life on vacation. Ain't nothing right about that. That's right. This is ridiculous. I wasn't charged with anything. He's my grandson. Ma'am, he may be returned to your custody once family court determines fitness, but not yet. Not ever. <sighs> Haven't you two done enough? I think you knew what your husband was doing in the basement all those years. I did not know. How would I know? When I first met Michael, he was wearing this. I, I knew I had seen it before. I, I got one for my daughters as a souvenir. It's a Mexican woven bracelet. You bought this for Michael while you were on vacation, right, Mary? Yeah. Maybe Pete did. But Pete's not in any of your vacation photos. And his passport expired years ago. I checked. Pete doesn't go on your trips around the world with you, does he, Mary? Pete married me, but he loved Kara. What else was I supposed to do? Leave, like Kara tried to. And go back to my old life? She wouldn't have lasted out there on her own for a week. That girl was useless. She was bound for trouble. If Pete wanted her, he could have her. Hands behind your back. You traded your daughter for cruises and spa days. She liked the attention. Oh, please, that's mine. I knew he would like that bracelet. Let's go. 